हेलो एवरीवन, आई एम मनाली रेशम वाला असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर फ्रॉम एलजी इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ फिजियोथेरापी टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट मेकेनिज्म ऑफ ब्रीदिंग इट इज़ अ पार्ट ऑफ सिलेबस फॉर फर्स्ट ईयर एज वेल एज फाइनल ईयर फिजियोथेरापी स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ गुजरात यूनिवर्सिटी लेट सी फर्स्ट द एनाटॉमी ऑफ रेस्परेटरी ट्रैक विच इंक्लूड्स नोज एंड माउथ फ्रॉम देर इट देर इज नेजल केविटी और ओरल केविटी फॉर्दर देर इज फेरिंग्स एंड लेरिंग्स Up to the larynx, it is known as upper respiratory tract, and after that, it is known as lower respiratory tract, which starts from trachea and includes tracheobronchial tree and lungs. Tracheobronchial tree starts from trachea, then it divides into primary bronchi, that is right and left uh, main bronchus. Following following it, there is secondary or lobar bronchi, then tertiary or segmental bronchi. bronchioles terminal bronchioles respiratory bronchioles and at the end there are the alveoli where a true respiration occurs that is of exchange of gas lobes of the lungs right side there are three namely upper lobe middle lobe and lower lobe and on the left side there is upper and lower lobe segments of the bronchi where uh, on the right side there are 10 segments In upper lobe, it includes apical, posterior, and anterior. Middle lobe, it includes lateral and medial. And in lower lobe, there are superior, medial, basal, anterior, basal, lateral, basal, and posterior basal segments. On the left side, there are also ten segments where first and second, that is apical, posterior, are joined together. Then anterior. In lingula, there is superior and inferior. And for lower lobe, there are superior, intro, medial, basal, lateral, basal, and posterior basal segments. muscles of respiration is ventilation is de- defined as inspiration and expiration the muscles of respiration are also divided into inspiratory muscles and expiratory muscles primary muscles responsible for inspiration are diaphragm and external intercostal muscles while accessory muscles are sternocleidomastoid scalenae anterior serratae and pectorals expiration is usually a passive recall of lung tissue but when forceful expiration is required muscles also required where primary muscles working are internal intercostal muscles and accessory muscles are abdominal muscles here is a in a figure on one side inspiratory muscles have been shown and on another side muscles for expiration are being shown mechanism of breathing mechanism of breathing includes movement of thoracic cage and movement of the lung first we will see about the thoracic cage there is enlargement of thorax during inspiration by increase in ap diameter that is intra posterior diameter transverse diameter and vertical diameter the change in size of the thoracic cavity is responsible for movement of following four structures one is thoracic lead which is made up of manubrium sterni and uh, first pair of ribs second is thoracic sorry upper costal series where uh, it includes second to sixth ribs third is lower costal series it includes 7th to 12th rib and diaphragm is a primary muscle for inspiration first is thoracic lead manubrium sterni and first pair of the ribs forms a thoracic lead and as we know that scalenae muscles are inserted on the first rib the contraction of scalenae muscle causes upward movement of the first rib because of that it moves manubrium sterni upward and forward thus there is increase in ap diameter upper costal series includes second to sixth pair of ribs it also includes ap diameter by movement called pump handle movement as we can see here the ribs are anteriorly attached with the sternum and posteriorly attached with the uh, thoracic spine the m- muscles for inspiration are external inco- intercostal muscles and contraction of it during inspiration leads elevation of these ribs and sternum moves upward and forward showing like a in a figure it sh- uh, it resembles like a pump handle movement next is third that is lower costal series which includes 7 to 10th pair of the ribs it increases transverse diameter of the thoracic cavity by pump hand- bucket handle movement here we can see uh, anteriorly and posteriorly the ribs is attached with sternum anteriorly sternum and posteriorly thoracic spine but the center part of the rib usually moves in the lower costal series 
so that it resembles like a bu- bucket handle movement when inspiratory muscles contract and movement of the rib occurs so because of that there is a um, upward and outward movement of these ribs and gradually it becomes more horizontal at the end of inspiration 11th and 12th ribs are floating ribs and does not take part in change in size of the thoracic cage last is the diaphragm which is responsible for increase in vertical diameter how as we know the diaphragm originates from all or the inner aspect of the thorax so cage that is posteriorly from the lower thoracic vertebrae uh, internally uh, laterally on the internal side of the ribs and anteriorly on the posterior aspect of the cephi sternum from everywhere the fibers of the diaphragm gathers at the center uh, and inserts in the central tendon so there is a central tendon in the diaphragm in between where the all the muscle fibers get inserted now this central tendon is working as a piston for increasing diameter vertically because in a normal condition in a resting position diaphragm is of ro- dome shape when there is contraction of diaphragm occurs it flattens down and in between the central tendon which also moves downward at the time of contraction at the time of relaxation it goes upward and at the time of re- uh, contraction it go- comes downward so this upward downward po- piston like movement helps thoracic cage to increase diameter vertically next is movement of the lungs during inspiration enlargement of the thoracic cage increases negative pressure in the thoracic cavity so there is movement of the air from the environment and expansion of the lung occurs during expiration increase in size of the thoracic cavity is going to decrease now so that pressure come back to pre inspiratory level so compression of the lungs occur and air is being expelled out thank you